I could really do without. Not really, I need it on my face, obviously, but like, it's not my favorite. Hi y'all, so I wanted to quickly groom my brows. So what I will do when I'm grooming my brows is I do a rough outline. So just pretty much kind of the shape or whatever, you know, this is not really perfect. And then whatever hair is left. Y'all can't even see, but we'll just clean up around it. Whatever is left underneath there, we'll clean that up. So I'm gonna outline it really quickly. Standing up this mirror hair, and I'm using this. I normally use Nair, but now I'm using this in place of the Nair. Roughly. But my timer just went off too, so I'm gonna wash it off and come back. So this is what this one looks like when I wipe it off of there. And this is something that I've been doing for years and years and years. Let me see. So you see how like around it is like very clean. You just really gotta have a steady hand for like applying the nair or whatever because you will <laughs> nair out your brows and have to draw them in. Has that happened to me before? Not really. I just messed up on like the parting or whatever like how it's supposed to look and I hated it. So um, I'm done. Did I use this in the nair? Let me rinse this real quick. So I'm not sure if I had used this in the Nair, so I just made sure that I washed it out. But for the most part, this is what they look like. And this lasts a very long time. Oh, I always love one and hate one. So this one, I absolutely love. This one and this one, oh, I could really do without. Not really, I need it on my face, obviously, but like, it's not my favorite. I wash my face with like a little cleanser that I have. And um, I'm gonna moisturize with my Vino Daily Moisturizer. So, that's great. I guess it looks okay or whatever. I don't know. Done it a couple of times. But one always comes out like really, really nice. And then the other one always just blows me. Like, come on, bro. All the times I've been doing this, this is how you decided to come out. It's always how I feel about one. This moisturizer makes my face feel um, really good, but like just dry. Nice and smooth, but like very dry. So like this cleanser, I mean, you know, it just feels very dry afterwards. So I literally have to um, moisturize. So I'm putting back everything that I kind of like took out. I normally like go crazy underneath my chin here with the little scrubbing brush that I have, but I wasn't in the mood just now. I just wanted to wash off the veeps or whatever the thing is called. They said you're supposed to make sure that when you moisturize or even when you do um, skincare, your face specifically. They said, damn, I feel like I've said this so many times now because every time I start talking about it, he starts telling me something. They said, when you do skincare, Specifically for like your face or whatever you should make sure that you like get your neck So if you're using like a cleanser or whatever you're supposed to like get your neck too and I feel like I didn't know that for a very very long time So I feel like right now like my face is a little bit lighter than my neck because this is where I wash And so like you're you're able to see that you know this aspect of like my body I've been taking care of in terms of like cleansing and like moisturizing or whatever and then hair it's like I've just neglected it separate from like when I'm gonna shower or whatever so that's exciting I just got up and like made some breakfast or whatever and we were supposed to be going to the gym at 10 o'clock when he got his break and like came home but that's not happening anymore it's 19 degrees outside and don't nobody want to be outside at night so it's looking a little slow for that so i think i'm gonna just sit here and like do some little things that i've been meaning to do on my phone i have my little planner right here and i have the oh it looks good here's the thing you see when i have time look, oh boy's an embarrassment 
phone can't even recognize my eyebrows look so good my phone don't know who the hell I am so we're not gonna be going to the gym so I need to go get back into doing my at home workouts because I can't just sit here and not do anything today is day 8 of being at home and <laughs> Now I'm kind of developing a routine in terms of getting up and getting ready and like trying to get a few things done that I um that I have to do but for the most part yeah all right check that off the to-do list I have this one place that I need to research this is indeed what I'm looking for all right so I'm gonna pretty much use the rest of um or at least the next couple hours to like do some research and see what I got going on. But I'll see you guys later. So I'm sitting down here just now with this gentleman and um, I saw this little hat that my friend got me for Christmas and I just wanna see. I love it. I literally look like I have my life together. I'm telling you about clothes and like shit like this will literally make you look like you, you have it together. I know, the, Chris the Christmas, you know what I'm saying? The Christmas. <laughs> pillows and stuff we're just not gonna get into that because like we're not i'm trying to buy a christmas tree um bag to put the christmas tree in so yes while you're watching this the christmas tree is still up don't judge me you know what i'm saying the good thing is the upside to all of this is i haven't been turning it on so i guess that kind of excuses me having it up still we do it now <laughs> I don't know what I'm waiting on to buy the bag so I can take it down and just put all the Christmas decor inside of the same bag and that be it until December not even December like October because I'm putting it up early so I can enjoy it for longer 